Hello everyone, Pixeled Monk here, and welcome to an old school RuneScape guide showing you how to complete the quest, Wanted. This quest is considered intermediate difficulty and is long length, about 35 minutes. The requirements for this quest include 32 quest points, completion of Recruitment Drive, Rune Mysteries, the Lost Tribe and Priest in Peril quests, and the ability to defeat two Black Knights and Solus Delagar. The required items for this quest include 20 unnoted rune or pure essence, 10,000 coins or one law rune, an enchanted gem, and one molten glass. Although not required, it is highly recommended that you also have melee gear, amulet of glory, teleports to major cities, games necklace, ectophile or draymond or lunar staff, and a light source. There are some maps in the description below that help you to identify some of the key points of this quest. Open it up to keep it handy. To start the quest, you must first go to Sir Tiffy Cassian, who is located in the Falador Park. Use the Falador Teleport to get there fast, and then walk east. Talk to Sir Tiffy, and when prompted, ask if he has any jobs for you. After the conversation, go to the White Knight's Castle just southwest of you. Enter the door to the west and climb the stairs to the third floor. Talk to Sir Amik Vars. When prompted, select No, Not Right Now. Afterwards, go back to Sir Tiffy in the park and talk to him. He should start talking about a crisis. If he doesn't, keep talking to him. When complete, head back to Sir Amik and talk to him. When prompted, select Sure, I'll help you. Now go back and talk to Sir Tiffy again. He will make a Calm Orb for you, but be sure to have one empty inventory space to collect it. If you have brought the 10,000 coins, select Buy One. If you have brought the Law Rune, Enchanted Gem, and Molten Glass, select Have One Made. He will then give you a Com Orb. Right click on the Com Orb and select Contact. Savant will talk to you. When prompted, select Current Assignment. Now you'll have to go to the Taverly Dungeon, which is located northwest of Falador. You can use a level 5 agility shortcut on Falador's western wall to get there a little faster. Before entering the dungeon, be aware that there are aggressive enemies down here. If you are a lower level, using Protect from Melee might be helpful. Enter the dungeon when ready. Use the map given in the description and follow it all the way around and south to the Black Knight's base. Once there, enter the double doors to the south. Talk to Lord Decarius, who is located in the southwestern room. If Savant from the Com Orb doesn't automatically contact you, right click on your Com Orb and select Contact. When prompted, select Current Assignment. Afterwards, kill one of the Black Knights nearby. Lord Decarius will tell you to stop. Talk to him again. Now use your Amulet of Glory and teleport to Edgeville. For this next part of the quest, you will briefly need to run into the wilderness. When ready, cross the wilderness ditch and run north along the river until you get to the Mage of Zamorak. Talk to him. Afterwards, teleport to Varrock. Be sure to deposit any god items that you may have on. Walk to the southeastern portion of Rock to the Chaos Altar. Talk to the Mage of Zamorak. When prompted, select Solus Delagar. Talk to him again to give him the Rune of Pure Essence. 
Now you'll need to go to Canifis. You can either use your ectophile, the fairy ring located in Edgeville to code CKS, or simply walk to get there. As you near Canifis, Savant will contact you. Continue walking into Canifis, then left click on your com orb to scan. Keep walking around town and scanning until Solus appears. A cutscene will occur. Solus will disappear, however Savant is able to pull random items off of him which will help you in determining where he has teleported to. For example, I received a toy horsey, which means that Solus is located in Drainer Village near Diango. There are a variety of different items which are listed here to help you out. Teleport to the appropriate location and use the com orb to scan the area. You will have to do this several times. Eventually when he appears, he will attack you with Flames of Zamorak, which can hit you for a majority of your health, however it will not kill you. At the second to last location, Solus will summon a Black Knight. Kill it. Your last clue will be 20 noted Pure or Rune Essence depending on what you originally brought to the Mage of Zamorak. This means that Solus will be located in the Rune Essence Mine. At this point, head to a bank and get ready for the final fight. When ready, head to the Rune Essence Mine, Solus will attack you with melee and is overall fairly easy to defeat. When you have defeated him, go back to Sir Amik Vars in Falador. Talk to him to complete the quest. Congratulations, you have received one quest point, 5000 Slayer experience, and access to the White Knight's Armory. Thank you so much for watching, I hope that you enjoyed this guide and found it helpful. If you did, please subscribe for more, and I'll see you next time.